Bag Chemistry, and especially this is our first Friday demo. During uh, first quarter, we'll try to bring you some entertaining Friday demos. Yes. Uh, I watch football. What? We do? No. He's Friday demo, football. and actually, you know what? It might have something to do with football. Right? Yes. And we're playing. You know what? It might. So first of all, I want to introduce myself. I am Mr. Houston. Uh, Mrs. Stone also teaches chemistry, Mrs. Villardo, and Mrs. Cooper is right here. So, um, and also, Mr. Geyer, you might see him from time to time, although now he's got an AP class. So hopefully, uh, it'll be somewhat entertaining, and hope, you hope to learn a little bit of chemistry. But what we're going to try to do on this very stage right here is to symbolically, hopefully, recreate the game tonight. Uh, what's going to happen? So does anybody know who we're playing tonight? Lawn Hills. Lawn Hills. Hills. Okay, so let's see. Lawn let's try to recreate what, what's, what's going to happen. So, of course, big game. Everyone gets it like 30. We're tailgating. We're having a good time. Everything fun's happening. And all of a sudden, about, oh, 730, the sun starts to go down. Oh, it's amazing. We spare almost no expense to bring you uh Okay, so, uh, and then, and then, of course, we're all getting very excited like this, and the band's going, and people are cheering, and things are kind of crowded, the parking lot's overflowing, and then the uh, game's going to start, so, of course, the people need, need to go ahead and get on the um, playing field, so this is the symbolic playing field we have right here, and of course, so, here comes Sycamore High School, and the, the uh, team comes on, on the field, and they're jumping up and down, and kind of, like, hitting each other like this, and bumping into each other, and all what football players do, and all that, and then here comes Walnut Hills, boo. Right? So they're coming in, and as you can see, they're so scared they can't even get out of the tunnel. Look at that. They're kind of like, they're having trouble getting out. So, okay, so they're coming out, and they're getting on the field, and they're jumping up and down. The crowd's going crazy and all that. So then the game starts, right, in its first quarter, and unfortunately they mix it up. <laughs> Thanks for laughing. I appreciate it. Okay, so they mix it up, and Walnut Hills, unfortunately, um, plows down. They go all the way downfield. And they're the first one to score, and it's seven nothing. One and goes at the end of the first quarter. But then our guys, they really get revved up, and the coach kind of has a hard part with them, and they go charging back down the field, and they score seven points in the second quarter, and then it's all tied up in the second quarter, seven seven, and then it goes to halftime, and of course it goes to halftime, and then of course the band, you know, the band runs out, they kind of you know they do their thing and they play play play, and then they run back off. And I think does anybody know what the band's playing? Anybody know what the band's playing? Is that a song or is that like? It's a show. A show. Okay, so anyway, they're doing a show, film noir. Uh, okay, so then the third quarter starts. A Lawn Hills is all charged up, and they go back down the field, and they're plowing ahead, plowing ahead, plowing ahead, and they score 14-7. And then it's fourth quarter, and we get the ball, and we're going all the way down the field, and we're like on the on the ten yard line. There's like a minute to go, and we're like, oh my gosh, this is incredible. It's 14-14, and coach is like, timeout, 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 you know. And, it was, it was all tied up because we had scored again and we got the ball. We're, we're trying to score to win the game and we're like, time out, time out. And so he's like, oh my gosh, what are we going to do? And the team is almost dead and, and we're like, hey, you know, we're okay. We've got be better living through chemistry. We could probably swim. Well, it turns out that these little munchkins, you know, they run onto the field and kind of go like this and they got all these bottles and the guys are trying to get a pull the helmet and they spray you know, with water and all this stuff. Well, we're like, we can help the team out because unknown to the coach, we decided we're going to put a little magical elixir into the water bottles and see if we can kind of get our team going completely legal, of course. So, uh, here's what we do. So, we're like, okay, let's do it. So, we sneak it in there. And the team's like, oh, man, we can do this, right? We're gonna, we can get all revved up here. So, of course, here we go. And then it's the last play of the game. It's tied 14-14, and we gotta get it in. It's fourth. It's fourth down in the fourth quarter. With only 10 seconds to go. So let's see what happened once we added a little bit of our match to extra. Here we go. Woo! Holy cow, Batman! And so the team bursts into flames, and they burn up Walnut Hills. And the other team, they score the points. We win the game, and they're all dead on the field. And I'm thrown in jail for involuntary manslaughter. I don't know. But we win the game anyway. And there we go. We get a big round of applause. <laughs> okay. So, what really happened here? Um, okay. So, let's start off. This is me at the beginning of the year. The definition of chemistry, right? This isn't magic or anything. This is chemistry. It's the, um, uh, the study of matter and how it interacts. Okay. So, let's talk about what happened. Hey, we're burning some stuff. What is the... Stuff smell like. Anybody, anybody got an idea what that stuff smells like? Very smoke. common. Oh, smells like smoke, right? Where have you smelled that smoke before, maybe? Like, uh, like what? 
Like, okay, well, uh, anybody like to roast marshmallows? Yeah, uh, maybe. Okay, I do. Well, anyway, okay, so one of those smells is actually sugar. And why? Sugar has carbon, and carbon is a nice fuel. Uh, now, what else do we need to burn stuff to have that matter interacting with chemistry? Fire. Uh, oxygen and like fire or spark. Oxygen came from the other chemical we had where there was oxygen inside it that we had to get out somehow. Okay, that was the other, that was the Wall and Hills team. And lo and behold, we have oxygen, we have carbon, but what else do we need to get a fire going? A spark, right? Okay, this is a very, 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 very strong concentrated acid. We put it on there, it rips the bonds apart, and when it does that, it gives off lots of energy. We've got oxygen, right? We've got energy. We've got uh, we've got uh, carbon. We have a, uh, a a nice fire, of course, for us to um, blow away water. And then um, also, did any, anybody notice what color it was? Did you make an observation there? Okay. Like pink or red? Okay. Uh, typically, what happens is to get and we'll learn a whole bunch about this. Different metals, okay, give off different colors when they get excited. Uh, red is like strontium. Uh, orange is sodium. White is magnesium, and when you watch the WEB and fireworks, maybe uh, you'll see this. They do it the same way, just on a much bigger scale. Okay, with a license too, by the way. Okay, so uh, that being said, let's don't forget to have a great weekend. Have a safe weekend. Make sure you go to the book right in, boys. Woo!